Hello everyone, this is Lisa from Grateful Me. I'm so glad that we're together back again to do our 100 Envelope Savings Challenge. This has been a fun week. I just finished doing up one of my um, side jobs that I have, and so I thought it'd be a perfect time to stuff some envelopes for our challenge. So this week, I'm going to do two envelopes. I'm going to do number 52 and number 62. So let's get going. Let's start with 62 first. There's 20, 40, 60, 61, and $62. Here's some flower washi tape. I uh, Today I spent my day helping my, my mom out, and then I planted her flowers, and then I went to the greenhouse and got me some more flowers for my yard. I am just a flower lover, so this is the time of year where I like to spend a lot of money. So I'm glad that my envelopes have this little stick and pill so that I can't get into them, or I probably would go and spend it all at the greenhouse. One of my big weaknesses and guilty pleasures. All right, 52 is the next one. Let's go ahead and stuff that one. There's 20, 40, whoops, 45, 50, 51, and $52. And let's get this in here and then I'm gonna fill in my um, envelope savings tracker I'm really curious to see how many envelopes we have left to complete this challenge so there was 52 and 62 let's see move these envelopes over here fifty two right here How about a green one? So another one of my guilty treasures and pleasures lately have been adult coloring books. I love to color and I'm excited because Amazon should be dropping me off a delivery of three new books that I got. Um, each of my books, I color a few pages in them and then I buy me a new one. So I need to really make it a goal to complete at least one book all the way through. I don't know if there's anyone out there like me, but sometimes the fun is in the buying and not so much in the doing, <laughs> which is terrible. Okay, 62. Color this one in. I uh, have a great weekend planned. My family, we're going to go to the zoo. We have an amazing zoo next to where I live. So we're going to do that this weekend. And we're going to get together and have dinner together. And then play some games. And also we're going to do our preparedness weekend um our preparedness night this time we're going to give our kids um like tool kits that go inside their cars in case of emergencies the kind that have like the flares and the lights how to fix tire you know all the stuff to fix your tires and then we're going to go a little bit further because where we live in the winter time it's cold we're going to put together like um a bin full of like warm clothes and blankets or anything in case there's ever a time when they have an accident or they're stranded in their car so every month we try to pick a different area of preparedness and that's what we will be doing this weekend as well so number 62 and 52 I am going to go ahead and count now how many envelopes we have left in our challenge. So I started this challenge January 1st, and then my goal is to have it done by October 1st, 
kind of have it accelerated so that I can use it for our family vacation. And then when we get home, we're gonna work on our basement. So let's see, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 envelopes left. I am so excited, that sounds so doable to me. So out of the 100, I only have 19 left. At the end of the video, I'll go ahead and leave the total. I know that we've passed the $3,000 mark, obviously, and we're probably very close to $4,000. So how exciting. We do have some bigger ones left, like we have some 70s, 192, and then the rest are 40s and 50s. So I'm feeling good about that. I hope everyone has a great week, and I hope you all uh, work on your 100 envelope savings challenge, whether you do one envelope or two, or you put some money aside every time you get paid. Whatever you decide to do, it will bring you closer to your goal, so just keep going. Um, I'm very grateful for everyone, and as always, I hope you have a great weekend and that you feel many wonderful things to be grateful for. Bye until next time.